How's it going guys? Dre here and welcome back to another episode of Bridge Constructor Portal. Now today we're on level 16 so we're slowly making our way through this game. Uh, we got another one of those goo levels. It's looking like uh, we need to go down here obviously, jump to the end, and we need to build a bridge across basically to get up here. So sounds simple enough, let's get right into it and uh, we're just going to build something like that. Now this is actually going to be a very difficult bridge to reinforce because we don't have too many points to use here. Uh, it automatically made this structure. I think I'm actually going to use it because we're not going to be able to connect to over to these. So that actually looks like a good idea. Now do we want to go... We'll try something like this for right now. Now that's not going to fit over there either. Alright, so let's do a triangle beam all the way across. Because this is probably the biggest actual bridge that we've had to build in this game so far. So this is actually kind of exciting. Alright, so again, these triangles aren't perfect, but uh... Neither is this bridge, that's for sure, so we'll try that for right now. And you know what, let's reinforce this a little bit by connecting to these two. Now we have this down here as well, let's just see... Oh, yeah, okay, so we're definitely gonna need a little bit more. Alright, so it's a web of supports, let's see, uh... I have no idea, oh man, it's just, I think I over-engineered this once again. Let's, uh, I saw that this broke here, so let's put that there like that. Is that gonna... Oh, okay. Don't want that thing bending because that's just gonna have problems. We cannot connect to that one over there because there's that thing in the way. That might actually... Ooh. Okay, I think this might be okay. Again, the convoy might give me an issue, but is this all we need? Do we even need a landing? No, we don't. So there we go. At least we did that. Let's see if this bridge can hold up with the convoy. It is so shaky, but I think there's only going to be a couple on at a time. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, I think we got it. Yeah, we totally got it. Man, that was too close to breaking though. And it looks like all of them made it across as well, so no complaints. Good start today. Uh, didn't really take too long to do that one, so that was fun. That was an actual bridge building level too. Ooh, is this? Yeah, this is the bounce goo. I remember this stuff. In this test, the blue aperture science repulsion gel will reflect any objects that fall onto it. All right, so simple enough. That's basically a big bouncy pad, and I Please like the sound of that. Please all the fun that the vehicle drivers will have. All right, well, I obviously know what we got to do for this one. We have the exit up here. We need to jump on the bounce pad and then jump inside here. So first of all, let's just see how much air we get on this jump so we can see kind of where we have to build because I'm assuming I have to build a little bit of a landing pad oh god it jumped upside down and you know what they didn't get too much air so what I'm gonna try and do is something like this for right now and actually what we can probably do can we just hold this up with cords you think I mean it is a landing pad I think it's gonna need more structure so yeah we're gonna do it just in case and I'm just gonna put another triangle bridge over here. All right, I'm still worried. Yeah, you can see all oh, those poor, poor ropes. All right, so let's actually maybe lower this by quite a bit. Oh, that actually deleted it. Great, I don't know why. Oh, you can't overlap things in this game? So because that cord's there, I can't have this thing there. That's slightly annoying. I have to move it up a little bit. All right, let's try something like that. And it should be lighter. Man, that is so not gonna support something landing on it though so and the fact is he does a somersault okay oh you almost made it man when in doubt add more supports oh come on okay so that's fine like that i actually might totally no it, it basically landed in the middle so i just want a little bit of space there and we are going to highly lighten this because i don't think we need the support of it that actually looks really good. Let's try and drive. It should be, yeah, much more stable. And with all those ropes, I don't think it's breaking. The one thing we might have an issue with, though, is this thing likes to flip. So we're going to have to somersault on that. And in the convoy, I don't know if that's going to go very well. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we don't have enough speed to make it to the bounce pad as well. All right, I've been working on trying to smoothen the landing because the only thing I know that we can do is uh, basically speed it up here. There's no way we're going to be able to speed it up up here. So I have to get it going through the portal faster. So I've been fine tuning this bridge. There we go. That's perfect. I wanted the somersault as fast as possible. And is that going to be enough? Yes, indeed. 
It is, but oh my god, do we ever have to build a big bridge up there? We almost went right back in it. That would have been great to have an endless loop. Okay, so first part's done. I actually want to see again. I really wish the one thing I, I hate about this game is there's no fast forward button. So you can't, you know, quickly test something and see if, you know, your minute change changed anything. But I just want to see how far we go so we know we have to build here. So kind of eye it. Looks like we need to build to kind of the middle of our ramp. So that's actually not as bad as I expected. We should be able to do something like that, and that should be all we hopefully need. But of course, we can obviously do some fine tuning if we do need to. So something like that should be good. Um, do we want some underside support? I think we should actually probably connect both of these together just to be safe. So let's try that. And again, money doesn't seem to be a big issue here. It's just kind of a goal that you can do. It's optional. So if it's not a big issue, why not go crazy and we'll see if this, I mean, I'm worried about the weight now, but we should be okay. The ba the bottom's exactly the same as long as we're keeping the speed, which we did. We might get it right here. You never know. Come on. Oh my God, that's so close. Dude, look at that. Calculated and perfectly done. That feels great. Let's try the convoy though. This is when it's gonna get bad, I think. Uh, again, unless they're spread out enough, which, Again, there's always going to be a couple on it, and especially at the top and the bottom, this might get a little scary. Oh my god, we're doing the crisscross too. Oh god, clench your butts, guys, because <laughs> this is crazy. It's working! How the heck? Look at how wobbly it is, yet it's still freaking doing it. Uh-oh, I, I just broke! It broke! No! I jinxed it. I jinxed it, man. <laughs> we got guys going through multiple times. That guy just switched it. Right into the portal. That was impressive all in itself. All right, so we got, what do we get? Five out of eight. I think at this point, this is one that's gonna, gonna get a little too difficult to do everything perfectly. So let's see if we can beat five out of eight. If we can get eight out of eight, great. I'm gonna go back to build and just reinforce this a little bit, I think. The major issue is the shake. That's what can really screw it up. It's kind of like an earthquake. A few minute, you know, changes can really rock a bridge. And you can see that top piece is just getting banged and there it goes same thing happened once again oh it might be able to hold it though my reinforcements oh no no <laughs> come on one zero okay two well they were all the one that guy should have made it he was up there already all right lowered the uh top bridge and then i added another spider web of structural support in this uh at this point i'm pretty sure i'm over engineering but as you can see it seems to be shaking a lot less so if we can make it and it's a little bit less bouncy at the top. This bottom, though, is scaring me now, though. It's turning really red. Come on, man. Come on. Bottom's done. What? What happened to him? What happened to you? Can I get an explanation, please? Oh, maybe he can make it, though. No, he's definitely not going to make it. He's too slow now. Oh, well, we upgraded to six. I think I'm happy with that one, guys. I lied. I couldn't help myself. I got to try one more time at this point. Oh, God. There, it, It's worse. It's worse. Officially, I have over-engineered it, guys. Oh, my God. Did you see that explosion? So, uh, yeah. I, th I think I'm happy with what we got. All right. This one's called simply Bounce to Kill. So, let's just try it first because there's a... Uh, well, what is this thing over here? Okay. So, we got a bounce pad. We got a sentry over there. Oh. Oh, and it bounces us up. Okay, so I think I already have an idea on how to do this one. We need to utilize this bounce to take out the sentry. Now, we can go through the blues. So, basically, what I think we got to do is build something that goes up here. And then drops down, bounces over, hits the sentry. And ultimately, if we get lucky, kills it. That's the goal anyways. We never know what happens until we do it though. So let's just do a very, very simple bridge right now. That actually should be enough to deal with the impact. Or I thought I thought we could lean it on that. Mm, that is not the case. That's all right. We'll just add some more stability then. This is gonna be actually, let's um let's lower this incline a little bit since we can. We're just gonna put a little thing there and then reinforce it with that. Turn that into a piston as well. That way, we're not hitting it so hard, and it's not going to hurt itself as much. There we go. That one should be okay. And bam, right into that. Oh, what am I going to do in this regard? Because I hit the wall and totally stop. 
So now that I'm looking at it, I think I actually need to slow the beast down. So I'm going to intentionally make this a bigger incline than it needs. And uh, if we can... Oh, God. Okay, I broke something there. We'll see if this uh, helps it a little bit, though. That definitely slowed it down. I unfortunately got rid of my one support joint. So let's just bring this... Uh, what are we doing at this point? What is going on? What am I creating? Getting closer! Okay, so this first hit really slows it down. Does a little jump, which slows it down even more. Yes! Yes, that's perfect! Right? Am I, am I going? Oh, I'm too slow now! Oh, man, I thought I had that. Oh, yeah, son! That's what I'm talking about. Can we roll over? And then we get launched up. Now, it's not perfect, but getting that trajectory perfect is, uh... Not easy at all. So you can see the little jump. It slows down just enough to not hit his head off that. And you can't get much luckier than that because we do land it perfectly. The one downside is I flip over here, but I don't know if I can fix that at all. We might... Well, we should be able to... What can we build up here? So yeah, we could just build a landing pad over here. And then maybe we can jump over our arc that we make. All right, let's give it a shot, see how this works. I have no idea if we're going to land on our wheels or not. So the big question is, how we land up here? We know everything else works great, which is a good thing. Can we get through that hole? Can we thread the needle, if you will? Oh, my God, yes! Dude, dude, why am I so good at this sometimes? Now, unfortunately, okay, too slow. Uh, that's something we can possibly fix. Well, actually, we could probably just move this up and down a little bit. Do a little bit of a jump, because uh, I think it went a little bit further back. Problem being, this thing is definitely not rigid enough to support the convoy, so I'm kind of trying to address that before we even get to that point, just because I know I'm going to need to, so we're reinforcing this like crazy. Okay, All right, sorry. another fine tune. Let's see. We got less of a jump that we need to do, and that was the major issue. Oh, yes, yes. <gasps> No, what? Why did it not go as fast this time? It was definitely faster last time, and that's the problem. There's just random things that happen that really screw you up. I actually wonder if we move this back a bit and don't let it get hit, that might throw it even further back so it can get enough acceleration to do this jump. Now, what I really have to watch for right now is how much room do I have on this right-hand side, because the less of a jump we can do, the better. And yes, that's much better. Okay, okay, there we go. Yes! Okay, that was a perfect landing, too. Oh, the dream! We did it! Now, the big question is, the convoy's only three, so this starting thing, I mean, it's already red before anything even gets on it, so, oh my god. Ah, oh, you poor things. Go! Go! Yes! Oh, now hopefully we can move out of the way quick enough because this is crazy. What just blew up? Oh, that, that was the sentry. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Okay, come on, guys. Let's, uh, wait our turn here. Oh, this is actually gonna work. It's gonna work! Oh no! Come on, really? What if we just do something like that? Turn that into a that, and we'll see what happens when they hit it. Okay, let's see how much this screws them up. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that one is gonna make it. Yes! Tumble! Go! Why are you stuck? Are you serious? What the frig happened now? What? That doesn't even make sense! It's not even broken! What are you doing? Get over it! Wait, actually, this this might be good. This might be good. Come on! Come on, buddy! MVP right here! Oh, man, you are worthless. Are you gonna do it again? <laughs> Is this guy in an endless loop? All right, let's see what random crap happens this time. Going through perfectly. That's good to see. Uh, nice landing there. Oh, my God! No! Really? How are you going so slow? Oh, now you're gonna hit your friend? You know, you don't gotta play like that. Oh, you're gonna break everything. Okay, at this point, yeah, I, th I think we're back at square one. So we're gonna move on, but we did get two out of three. All right, on to 19, and we have high energy pellets that we gotta deal with. So these things, yeah, they do that. They like to kill things. Now, looking at this, okay, so we have an energy pellet, and it says if we hit it with here, we unlock this down here. So it said we can bounce these pellets off of uh, roads. So I'm thinking if we do something like this, you know, pull out my inner mini putt and if we can bank it off that and get it over there. Let's see if we get lucky and that's all we had to do. Oh yeah, perfect. Now we just gotta angle it right. Oh God, yeah, we, we already killed ourselves. So we gotta do it 
basically immediately. So now it's all about fine tuning this angle, finding the right way in which it wants to go. I think it's, oh, perfect. Right there like that, go over like that. And that unlocks that. So all we got to do now is build a big old bridge. Just like that. All right, let's see if we can get lucky first try and get it done. So there we go. That opens up that. We do that little jump like butter. And then, oh, wait. <laughs> what am I doing? Sir, what was I thinking? Did I, what? Sometimes even I surprise myself, guys. I have to be honest here. So we probably will be able to just do that and then jump it up. So... That should be good, and then we'll just put that down there like that. Just a minor tweak. Hopefully, we'll be able to get up that and get enough speed, which we should be able to. So yeah, the bridge that led to nowhere, hopefully now it leads somewhere, and that's exactly what happened. All right, so now we gotta do all five. This one wasn't too bad, actually. I do like the new mechanic, though. Uh, dealing with those balls is probably gonna be way more difficult as we go throughout these levels. Now, the big question is, oh God, that's gonna be a lot on this little bridge. Oh my god, it did it! Thank you, Bridge, you're MVP! And there we go. Finally, we did a five out of five. A perfect run. All right, level 20, high energy pellet number two. So it's probably gonna be a little harder than the last one. Oh my god, we got two sentries on both sides. Uh, where's the pellet coming from? Okay, so we got pellets down here. Let's just let's just drive and see what happens. Actually, I forgot about testing. Let's actually show you guys that. So in testing, it just shows you kind of what's going to happen. So the pellets are down here. We need to obviously bank them up and get them in this slot here. So basically all we need is two 45 degree angles and we should be able to send that block perfectly to where it needs to go. So something like that. Let's test that. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, that was very visually pleasing at least. Ah, <laughs> oh, just got to reinforce that a little bit. No big deal. Uh, can we connect to that? Of course we can't. We're like one pixel off, and I don't want to change the angle because that's just going to make this that much harder. So we'll just add a little bit of a triangle here and do the same thing over on this side. And if this is done, and if these go straight up, all we got to do is the exact same thing at the top, and then we have this part done. So, oh, it's still wobbling, which is going to make it a little bit off-center. We can't have any wobble here, so I think I got to connect them together and kind of have like an actual bridge set up going on. So we're just gonna do that, bring it over one square, and still 45 degrees. Let's test that again. I really wish I could copy this structure and put it up there though, that's perfect. All right, so now we gotta deal with the ball once it makes its way up there. All right, that actually looks really cool. So let's test it, and if my calculations are correct, yeah, that's what I like to see. Kill them with the companion cube. So, the question is, do I have enough time of this happening that I won't kill my guy? Whoa, I didn't even notice this over here. All right, so we got that done, though. So, yeah, one part of the mechanic done. This one, uh, it's probably so simple. I just, I can't think of, I guess I could bounce it kind of like we did with the actual balls and bounce it onto a bridge over there. So, if we turn that into road... And then do that. Let's see how far it goes. And then I can build a bridge this way, maybe? So yeah, something like that. And... Oh, this is gonna be fun, though. Alright, so let's just do a quick bridge, because, uh... Yeah, we're gonna have to do a lot of fine-tuning once again. So I don't like to waste time making the perfect bridge when I don't even know if it will work or not. So I'm just doing something here to keep it stabilized. And, oh my god, this... I do not like that these things don't snap into place. Uh, that's my major complaint with this game. I've said it many times already. It's just very, very frustrating when you just miss it just a little bit. All right, let's see. I don't know if that's enough to hold it, but I just want to see if it lands on it. And yeah, that's what I like to see. All right, now we can work on reinforcing this and making it a bit better because we obviously got it. Then all we need to do is do a very simple bridge over here, which I'll do really quickly. Oh, crap. Crap, I can't do a bridge because I need to let the ball go through. So, what I think I'm gonna do, we'll bring up a platform here. Just a little one like that. Turn this into a roadway, and we're gonna have just like a little skateboard down here that hopefully gives us enough speed to jump across this. So just a, a little lip, if you will. And I think that might be okay. Let's try. Now this bridge, I still haven't worked on this. I'm gonna have to work on it for the convoy, but it does enough to do it with this. And, oh crap, 
No! Well, that would have been great if it didn't break. Okay, so I, I didn't put any uh, actual reinforcement here. So we'll just put that like that. And this is all we really need to do. I mean, this is actually really reinforced. So let's try that again. I'm feeling pretty good about this, though. I think we got it. Balls easily make their way through. Again, uh, rickety bridge needs some work. But does the jump work? Oh, oh, okay. I can add just a little bit of an incline there. And we got it, man. We're totally good. So we'll do uh, that, I guess. And then, you know what? I don't even want to change that one because we don't need to touch that one. It was perfect. And we'll just add another tier of uh, reinforcements to this. That actually should be enough. And how many is in this convoy? What does it say anywhere? Yeah, we need five. So let's let's just give it a go and see what happens here. Oh, they're all going really quick, though. Oh, no, 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 no! Come on! All right, at least everything else is great. We just got to work on this thing. And really, it's not that hard. It's just a lot of time-consuming effort. All right, uh, a lot of fine-tuning later. We're on to something here now. Test number 57. Let's see if this thing works. Oh, my God. It is so heavy, though. Even under its own weight, it's having a hard time. Oh, God. But it's much smoother at the landing now, as you can see. Oh, my God. Come on. No! No! Run, little guy! Oh, really? I thought this was perfect over here. Oh, man. I thought I had it. Okay, how many got through? We got three out of five. I'm happy with that, but I'm gonna do my best to see... Well, first of all, I don't even know what happened over here, so I, got, I, I gotta watch that. Alright, first one goes by without any issues. Ooh, there's a lot of wobble, as you can see, though. Oh, and it just keeps pushing it over and over. So this actually should be an easy fix. Just put that there like that, that there like that, and hopefully that's enough to keep it rigid. Big question is, is this br bridge gonna break on us now? Look at how wobbly it is. I am amazed that, that that thing can even stay. All right, the other one's really wobbly, but as you can see, after a few small changes, we did it. Five out of five. That was a fun one, man. That one was not easy at all, and I think that was level 20. So let's, uh, actually, let's go to the main menu just to make sure. I don't know if I did 19 or 20 yet, but uh, I think we're going to end off if we did hit the big 20. Oh! Judging by the cutscene, yes, indeed, we did. What am I getting today? Last time I got my internet connection. This time, is this a sentry? What is this thing? Uh, is that a security cam? I don't know if I really want a security cam, but I guess I feel more secure. Congratulations, as a former trainee, chief custodian apprentice, you are now entitled to food and artificial sunlight. Ah, oh, I get food now, guys! Alright, well that feels pretty good, and, uh, oh, additionally you'll be enrolled in our continued testing program, so fear not, we have more to do, we did do 20, next one we have to do is back and forth, and it looks like we got at least 10 more to do, so I hope you guys are enjoying this game, once again, this is Bridge Constructor Portal, as always, thanks for watching and liking, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.